Welcome back everyone, my name is Decrave and this is some more Stellaris Leviathans playing with Heinlein's patch, of course. And this is our fleet. Um, we apparently have more cruisers than destroyers and the same amount of cruisers as corvettes. I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Um, it's apparently we're currently only at minus one money. Um, can we not say, buddies, um, land the armies maybe? Just to get them out of the way. I'm not. Don't think they can all land. Yeah, their six are stuck up here. That is fine. I can send them to a different world, I suppose, for now. To rim, probably. Can I? That would. Oh, that actually works. So if we right click, we actually swap completely. That's fine. Research agreement with the Thimoid autocracy ended. That's them. Okay. Yeah, so we are nearly... Yeah, okay, we are, of course, colonizing, which is also cutting into our money. Uh, let's see, you are working on minerals. You should upgrade that thing while you're at it. Um, this is a pure money world. Do we already have... No, we... Yes, we do have a power hub. This was also going to be a money world. So I'm just going to build another... Oh, land over there in the corner, put you there. Food is fine there. You are going to be... One, two... Yeah, research, if you look at everything. We have a few for money, and we're, of course, going to put money next to our um, capital building, but for the rest, it will be about the research. So we're actually going to also build a science lab over there. And what are you going to be? You are definitely going to be mm, credits. Uh, guarantee health and cartel. Sure thing, have fun with that. Lots of bad stuff has been encountered over there. I want that zero. Oh, whoa, what? <laughs> wow, we hadn't discovered them in a while. Okay, um. They're like literally in the end of this arm. Holy shit. That's, yeah, I think there's maybe another, yeah, there probably is another civilization up here. Don't know if that is a fallen empire or not. What do we have fallen-wise? We have the Spiron Remnant, the Natraxi Protectors. These are not fallen? No, they're not. I think it's those, oh, there's definitely something in between here. Complete. So, so far, and the Polarian Ancients, obviously, that's three. Maybe there's a fourth one up here, but I doubt it. You, oh man, that 10 physics research there, though. Beautiful. Construction complete. Farine stars. Yeah, that's fine. It really is for now. I do have to be careful with my influence income. Okay, so you are doing fine. Let's see, are people. Yep, they are. They're instantly leaving for the planet. Um, food-wise, you should actually be perfectly fine. Yeah, because you will lose the food, but also lose the need to use the food. So you're moving there. No one is actually moving off of our home world, which I'm fine with. Uh, you can upgrade that now. Mm-hmm. Could V. Good. I still need to find more money. Um, there is, of course, ocean and the continental that we want to terraform, but that is thirty-seven fifty in money. Ship hull even bigger. You know, we're at a hundred years, and some people have already made comments. You should be building battleships by now. You know what? I'm gonna research it. It's gonna take us 85 months, but <clears throat> we're actually gonna go research the battleships. Pash has been fully surveyed. Alright, we are surveying Fallen Empire stuff now. We still have that Zoad. Oh, it's such a ridiculous place. And Tadaska also has the Zoro. What? That's so unfair. There, huh, it's, um, you see this, it looks really weird, but that's a, um, empire that has risen up from the Dark Ages and 
put themselves in space, basically. As long as we're far away, they don't care about us. That's basically it. Oh, wow, they have cool buildings, though. Look at these. That does look cool. I mean, my fleet, one-on-one, -on -one can defeat possibly a fleet of the Pelerians. One-on-one. -on -one. That's about it. It's... Yeah, after that, it's just going to be pain. So... <laughs> integrate these guys, make them a... Uh... I can actually integrate them. Will cost 490 and influence of 5 per month. Hmm. Then I can... I will do that, and then I'll put them in a separate thing, my jig. Um, a sector, obviously. Sector for them, get some planets they might like in the neighborhood as well, that they are allowed to colonize. Not sure if they will, but they will be allowed. Do we have any more? Like, they have, I think it was ocean, right? Yeah. Oh, they have been unslaved. Okay, they're no longer slaves, apparently. Slave Separatist League. Von Mikon. Apparently that's a thing on this one, maybe. There are no slaves here. Unrestricted wars. Full orbital bombardment. Resettlement. Jesus, they really hate it here. But yeah, apparently they unslaved them. I don't really see any. Yeah, there's lingo, but that's not really possible for them. Um, how about this one? Oh, you're also coming to Cat V. Sure thing, why not? More the merrier. And there. See, when I do this, he will instantly move them. No, he didn't. He doesn't this time. Yeah, now he does. <laughs> So they actually do things. It's impressive that I can actually even move them in the first place. But yeah. I still find it funny that we have like a face here with the hairdo and stuff. That is funny. Um, maybe I should make them make this one. I mean, there is plenty of stuff I can sector up. Of course, Quad V and Terabellum would be things. Alpine, arid, arid, alpine. It would be pretty good to start making this into a sector, but... Or even over here, just expand the economic sector. I mean, Eklinda is focused on money, isn't it? System yeah. Complete. It is. So... Cheater Conus. Maybe I should do that. Yes, I will. So let's go to the planet and there's of course one other problem. How many sectors? I'm allowed four sectors in total. Okay. So they are transferring a lot of their money to us and they ha they have that much in the stockpile. Wow. I want this. That's that's unfair. But I can probably yeah, I'll do that. Um, so, we'll make it look a little bit weirder, but manage that sector. If I do that, that actually does impede my income, but... Tundra, Arid... I should start using some of these for maintenance, though. No, that's fine. It looks really weird now, and she just got Construction. a hat on or something. I don't know. This, this just looks weird. It does. And my money has gone down, but, but... What is there, Void Cloud? Hmm. The important thing is we can colonize another system again. There's a savanna world all the way up here, and there is quite some money around here, to be honest. 
And then again, it's not that great. Um, Shrek Council. Okay, where the hell are you guys? Oh, that's them. That's the people in the middle. Okay, let's actually look at Expansion Planner. Is colonizable is 100% for the Klingon. No, it won't be. 80% for the Klingon. There are two savannah worlds. Barbon 3. It also has high quality minerals and is huge. Where are you? All the way over... Yeah, no! No way am I gonna put myself next to a fallen militant isolationist empire. I mean, if it was a peaceful one, okay, we could have gone there, but not like this. Not like this. Um, okay, let's just go through a few of our systems. That's 47. 34. One world, one world, one, one. Just one, one, one. That's two for 32. How about further west? Just one world. Yeah. Looks like the best option we have is to go to Darep. What do we have here? 14 Arid Worlds. It's a 12. That's a 22. Also has Batarian Stone. I would like to terraform you, but for that I kind of need money. Um, and I currently have zero income. Spaceport. I did build the crew quarters here as well, so... Our ships are cheaper in maintenance while they are in orbit. Lands and sectors. Um, wow. Things we have to do to keep that up. Okay, can we maybe... Maybe get some leaders that give us money. All right. They're both qu quite useless. Well, there is a 4% increase for just basic stuff, but that's about it. Oh, they will live a long time, actually. That's fine. Um, we need to find a way to get money. Research. Once these guys, and then we make it into sector. That should help. They have a capacity. Climate restoration allows us to terraform ecologically devastated tomb worlds. That is pretty cool. Um, that is nearly done, actually. Regenerative hull tissue. Let's get a cheap one. Just the orbital farms. This one will long run help, actually. <laughs> okay, quad V2. We're building it now. Solar, solar. Solar, solar, solar. Also has... Okay, so all our spaceports have solar. Wow, they're really focusing on the money here. Uh, redevelopment. Yeah, that's fine. As long as they keep making us money. Overall, we're making money on our planets. Overall. That's been surveyed. That's a sizable fleet. 10k. You know what? You're going to be disbanded. I want you to come home. Um, well, these things do... Yeah, they only cost one maintenance, actually. Not even that bad. Yeah. That looks fine. <laughs> but we could get a suboptimal colony for now. It is still... Um... Still okay, planets. <laughs> Let's build up the Frontier Clinic here. So we grow a little bit faster. You're moving to two. Oh boy, everyone's coming in here, obviously. Um, Construction complete. This is a good point. Do I get someone with... No. There's only the output people right now. 
Bellmacosa, hmm. Terabellum. House food plus five. Um, you know what? For now, let's swap these two around so we have some income. <laughs> hmm. Need ten pops to upgrade that. You are also leaving yet. Yeah, they're also going to arrive next month. Which means this can be upgraded pretty damn freaking soon. Gonna be nuts. Poof! Everyone's here. Let's cancel that one for now. Wow. Does mean there are some buildings not working. But overall, they're only... They're no money building buildings. Okay, that's good. So, it's a savannah world, so your habitability is 75%. Uh, we'll still want to get the... Um, Frontier Clinic, yes. Swap you two around. And we'll also build a Monument of Purity over there in the corner. And Grand Duchy closed their borders to us. That's nice. Research complete. System survey. That's complete. the orbital farms. Leader lifespan plus five years. Um, let's just get farms. Sovereign Lachak's sons have stopped, closed their borders to us. The Andy Gonj kingdom has opened them. Oh wow, look at all of these people here. I think we've basically met everyone in the galaxy now. Well, galaxy. And yeah, galaxy. It's not the universe because, well, face the universe is a little bit freaking bigger. Oh, complete. when did they build that? I like it. So... It's pretty good, actually. So, yeah, you are working on the ship shelter. You can upgrade this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This has already been upgraded, yeah. Takes a while to build the things, though. I really should put the governor somewhere, though. Wow, now we get the tile blocker, guys. Seriously. So, cut V1. Let's get the new guy. Can I maybe hire some... Okay, then. Yeah, so you're going to be credits. Credits, credits, credits. How is the integration? Seriously? Can only place five on there now. Incredible. Research complete. System survey complete. Energy weapon coolant. Do we have anything that increases our money? Yes, we do. Quantum destabilizer. Oh, Auras! Sounds pretty cool. Fact on all those ships. Well, I'm gonna go with uh, that because we need the credits so bad. Badokan. Go to Amethyst. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Are they still there? I think so. That's also a shielded world. Impenetrable energy barrier. Well, at least our income has gone up a little bit. So, for now, we're still waiting on battleship research as well. I would like to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it. And subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future. I'll see you guys later.